I am the pig. I am the pig. I am the filthiest of animals. The mud covers me no matter how much I get clean. This mire will be my home until I die. I cannot recognize to go from where I sleep. To me, they are one and the same. What I eat is garbage. It is not pure, no matter how often it is clean or how well it is prepared. I eat to survive, for if I don't, I will die, ironically. What I eat is made of poison and it kills me. I was made to rule over all animals. However, through sin, my place was brought to the mud. The concept of clean to man is a joke to me. For the true mud will never be separated from me. The mud that covers me is sin. The farmer, the farmer that cares for me is also known as the shepherd. The farmer cleanses me all the time, for to him I am his pride and joy. I live surrounded by mud, leeches, and the worst filth. However, he cleanses me and cares for me like I'm a lamb. He is faithful and just and cleanses me regularly. However, no matter how much he cleanses me, I go back to the mud. I want to say I will never go back to the mud and stay clean, but I just can't. It's instinctive, and I will do it until I die. When I look at the farmer, I feel so ashamed. Not because he is disgusted, but because he looks at me with such love. When coyotes and wolves and hyenas and snakes come near, he chases them away. Other pigs fall victims to these fierce predators, but not me. For reasons that are beyond my logic and rationality, he is patient with me. Among the mud lay leeches that suck on me until they are full. These leeches are better known as temptation. They suck on my willpower until that mud mixed with my stew looks not like mud but the purest of oil that feels so smooth to the touch. When the allure of the oil fades, I see I am laying in the mud the farmer just cleansed me of. I don't want to lay in this mire covered in filth, but I want to fly, I want to fly high like the birds I see in the trees. I wish I had wings to fly high to the one that created me. As I look at this patient farmer, I can't help but know he all too well knows how this Maya is. He now walks on grass my paws have never seen. How I long to be free of this Maya. I made this to bring glory to Father God, Lord Jesus, and the Holy Spirit through Ruach Kadesh.
until that farmer calls me home. I will not be free of this mire. 